Hi everyone. So, welcome to React Native video calling app tutorial part 6. And in this part of tutorial, we will add the feature of call busy. That is, if one user calls another user, he will come to know whether he is available for call or his call is busy. So, let's see what changes we have made to make this feature happen. So, in the client side, if we go on the client side uh, and go to on answer function, uh, we have a condition to check if the user has uh, users the busy variable is false or true so if busy variable is false that means user is not busy but if busy variable is true then the call goes to the else part and <coughs> here we have added a message that we are sending to the to the server which is a message of type call busy so if a user calls uh, someone and uh, his call is uh, busy then the control will directly go to else part and we uh, a message will be sent to the server of type call busy okay another uh, change that we have made is uh, when the server receives uh, this message and the server sends another message to the client uh, the client or the user who is actually calling so uh, when server sends that message then the control will pass to on response uh, function and in on response function again we have a case busy so this is the part where uh, things will be handled and uh, then we are simply logging a message that uh, this user's call is busy and the when the user tried to make the call then busy variable was set to true so we are again setting it back to false and in call variable was also uh, assigned with the user's name uh, to whom call was being made so again we are uh, uh, reassigning this uh, in call with variable with empty string so uh, user uh, the calling user came to know that the call is busy and uh, he, he can now try some other user to call okay let's see what's happening in the server side in the server side uh, again uh, we have added a switch case that is case call busy so in the case call busy we are just sending a message to the call user who is making call and we are sending the message of type call response and the response is set to busy so when the uh, so when the server sends this message that time uh, the control goes to this part of on response and the calling user comes to know that the call is busy so it's very simple and very simple logic we have added uh, to notify the calling user that the call is busy so uh, let's go ahead and check things in action so let's first copy the code to our working file okay it's done so now let's go ahead and run the code so we have started our server and our server is running on port 4443 you can check the theoretical part of this tutorial by going to our website nobrook.com and uh, here we have complete series of tutorial
we have complete series of tutorial and you can just uh, check all the uh, parts and find out how to develop this react native video calling app so now let's uh, let's open the web client we need three web clients Okay. okay so let's log in users one by one so user a is logged in let's log user b user b is logged in let's log user c user c is also logged in okay now uh, user v will call user a okay user v is calling you the user a is getting notification user v is calling you at the same time user c is also trying to call user a sorry the call got rejected Okay, uh, let user A call user B. Okay, user A is being called, uh, user uh, B is being called by user A, and here we will accept the call. So when we accept the call, that time we set the busy variable to true. Now if uh, user C tries to call user B, user B should, uh, user C should get a uh, call busy notification. Okay, so the prompt is not coming, but user B, uh, user C is getting that user B call busy. So we are, our feature is working fine and we have successfully implemented call busy feature. And you can just come to our website and you can check all the series of react native video calling app part some of the series are uh, for premium members and i request you to go for the premium membership to and check the awesome videos that we have done uh, it will help you as well as it will help us uh, it will support us to uh, do more and more such type of uh, tutorials that will help you to build react native apps so thank you guys for being so wonderful and checking out my videos and thank you